Tuesday's arraignment of former President Donald Trump in New York was a first for the nation and brought out the passionate, the sensibly dressed, and the kind of men who really disappoint their mothers. Two genders! Two genders! Two genders! While I had fun getting into the scrum, I was surprised to find there were people who wanted to have meaningful conversations about the justice system. I don't believe we're, what, we're, what you're seeing is justice. You don't believe in the grand jury process? I don't believe if, if, if this was a, a civilian, it would... I mean, he is a civilian. He's a person who had a New York okay. address. So he shouldn't go through the grand jury process? I believe it should be uh, dismissed. Because? Because um, I... Uh, I'm going by a general gut feeling. The way I see it is, uh, you know, the, the government is uh, stepping over their bounds and doing what they're doing here, uh, indicting Donald Trump. Uh, this stuff happens all the time. What and, stuff? Uh, paying off a porn star and then uh, fudging business records? I mean, come on, it's his own money for one thing. And out of all the cases up against Donald Trump, this is probably the weakest one. It's probably the weakest one. No, uh, yeah. Yeah. There's no evidence to bring about this prosecution. So, uh, well, we don't I, know that until there's a grand jury who can then see that evidence. Uh, you know, listen, I, I think that uh, everyone everyone should uh, get, a, get a fair trial. So you would support a, a grand jury looking at all of the evidence, and if they decide to indict Donald Trump, well, then we, we will let that happen. Sure, certainly. If, they, if there's evidence, uh, you know, every, every piece of evidence should be heard. Well, I mean, that's what happened here. Mm. There's an excitement in the air. It feels almost like the American version of a royal event. If the king f***ed a porn star, paid her, and then lied about it in business records. Like an American coronation. And then the Donald arrived. The former leader of the free world was now possibly in the same room as a group of recently busted subway masturbators. I think he wants the media. You think he orchestrated all of this? Yeah, because his, his polls, were, like DeSantis, was sort of, was rising. Now, he's taking all the air out of the room now, Trump. In 2016, he had all the media, Fox News, yeah. CNN was coming. Now they don't cover him anymore. Now they have to. Getting arrested is the smartest That's thing it. he could do. He's like one of the smartest guys that uh, I know. You're talking started, about the man who's getting fingerprinted inside that building right now. I think they fingerprinted him already. They have, they have his DNA. That guy's left his DNA in a lot Listen, of different places. This is like the seventh time. Could Trump run his election campaign from prison? He, he could do anything, Trump. Yeah. He's, Would that dissuade if, you in any they, way? Even if they give him 34 felonies, you know, it's just like Trump. Is, he's untouchable. He's untouchable, except the person who's literally touching his fingerprints right now. Have you donated to the Trump campaign since he was? I haven't thought about it up until now, but I guess uh, I'd consider it. Sure. Trump has fundraised like over $5 million for this. So in some ways, it's almost like he's getting paid to have sex. Is he a sex worker? I mean, it's cool. There's no judgment. Look, I think you guys are great. I love senses of humor. But in many ways, you should appreciate this is not funny. Because they're going after Trump today. They'll go after me tomorrow. And then they'll go after you. Did you pay off a porn star and then lie about your business records? Oh. I'm sorry, that's gotta be frightening. I guess he could come for us if Listen. we've been involved in hush money payments and then lying on our business records um, and then I mean, uh, using that uh, when it yeah. comes to the campaign as uh, well. Like, uh, I guess uh, that could happen to anybody. Perhaps we don't need justice to be blind, just friendly.